I think we took our foot off the gas. You know, they played harder than us, and we didn't match their energy. And they found momentum, and a couple shots went in. And you know, now we find ourselves, uh, you know, in a, uh, just trying to survive. So I thought we just uh, had that bad stretch at the end of the third, start of the fourth, and uh, uh, you know, I, I, frankly, I think we just took our foot off the gas. In that closing stretch, I mean, you had Bruce with the corner three to tie, and then James, Joe, and Kevin kind of. Uh, seven them out. Just what, what do you think of the play down the stretch? That's, that's yeah, really you know, down the stretch was pretty solid. I mean, Kevin obviously uh, went to work. We got him the ball in good spots. Uh, he made a play for for BG, and uh, just overall, we executed offensively down the stretch. And our defense picked up in the last couple of minutes. But uh, you know, a lot of good things tonight. Just um, you know, just in each half, we had a, a period where we you know uh, kind of relented our will and, and allowed them to get back into it. Now you touched on it a little bit, but I mean, when you clearly see momentum in a game like that in that fashion, just how valuable is it to have a veteran leadership like you have, and to have you know kind of a singular talent like Kevin, where you can go to him and let him cook, let him work. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, that's obviously the, the story of the closing minutes. I mean, I know James made a couple plays, and Joe and BG got some buckets, but Kevin just being able to, to get him the ball in the spots. Uh, you know, he, he made baskets. He also made a play for BG and got doubled, got Joe, I mean, sorry, got uh, James a three. So, uh, you know, we played through him and um, he delivered, of course. Steve, I know when James got to the line for team kind of, but what really got James kind of going tonight? Yeah, I thought after the first time out of the first quarter, you know, he got really aggressive. Um, you know, really tried to get in the paint. We've, as we've been preaching, play early, try to attack early, try to get in the paint, and he did a great job of that. He's been kind of talking about how he was building his confidence and building his way back. I mean, do you feel like tonight you look like he's all the way back? Uh, and I think it's, it's you know, he played similar tonight as he did, you know, uh, a couple games on this trip for sure. Uh, I think we got to be patient with him. You know, it's, uh, it's still, um, I think, got some yards to go before he feels this way every night or feels at his best you know there's the the fitness there's the rhythm and then there's the confidence like I said so you know for all those three things to come back it does take time he was great tonight he's been really good the last week or so and trending in the right direction but I don't want to get too carried away let's let give him time to get his game back and just to ask about Joe's starting in five or six plays in the first half yeah I mean just electric shooting from Joe uh you know, we you know, we had some lapses where our game could have been a lot. Uh, the game could have been, we could have had more separation at, at halftime. But, you know, we also, if Joe didn't shoot the ball that well, could have been in a, in a much tighter game at halftime. So, um, you know, I think tonight was one of those nights where the offense was there for the most part, other than a stretch at the uh, end of the third, start of the fourth. Uh, the defense can be better. That wasn't our best outing defensively.